Hello and welcome to the Mobirin channel. In this video, we'll be continuing with part 2 of the Beifeng BBS HD Motor Maintenance and Repair Guide. If your motor isn't rotating, makes a metallic grinding sound, or experiences intermittent cutoffs, we'll explore the causes and learn how to fix them. BBS HD Beifeng Motor Repair Guide Part 2 First, let's talk about the most common issue. If the large pinion gear is broken, the motor won't move and will produce noise. To fix this, simply remove the cover of the large pinion gear and replace it with a new one. Remember, it's recommended to replace the pinion gear grease every 10,000 kilometers. If you notice issues with the thrust bearings and needle bearings, the crank axle may not move smoothly when pulled or pushed. Another problem to look out for is if your chainring seems to wobble from side to side, which can cause frequent chain disengagements. To address this, open the cover and pull the axle to separate it. Be careful not to break the speed sensor magnet while doing this, it is sensitive to grease. Next, remove the thrust bearing. If there are deformations, it might not come out easily. Detach the rubber cover from the axle. Use a rod from the opposite side to gently tap and separate the thrust bearing. For the BBS HD needle bearing, you can use a flathead screwdriver to gently tap around the edges to gradually remove it. Now that the needle bearing is separated, the new one you ordered should be identical in size, so you can use it directly. Apply some grease to the bearing. box wrench socket 17 millimeters fits perfectly with the outer diameter. Please use a rubber hammer to tap it. The rubber ring has a ring-shaped side, and that's the inner side. To ensure waterproofing, fill the bearing with grease. Next, install the rubber ring. Now, let's proceed with installing the thrust bearing. Apply bearing grease into the hole. Then, slide the bearing housing on by hand. You can also use an 18mm socket box wrench. Grease it up and install the thrust ball bearing. Grease it up and slide the thrust ball bearing housing into the hole. Now, put the crank arm axle back in place and the needle bearing and thrust bearing swap are complete. Now, let's remove the contaminated grease. Use parts cleaner to remove the old grease. The grease is molybdenum, so it's black in color. Be careful not to let the parts cleaner flow into the small pinion gear area as you clean. Spray cleaner on a brush and clean the gear teeth. Follow the same method to remove the old grease from the large pinion gear. Apply black molybdenum grease or bearing grease like Mobile 28. Now, put on the clutch. If it spins freely, it means you've put it on the wrong way. 
It should only rotate in one direction. For the small pinion gear, apply grease for waterproofing. Put on the gasket and cover. Tighten the bolts gradually in the farthest order. Motor repair is complete. Power transmission delay. This phenomenon occurs when the plastic clutch bearing is faulty. The bike's power is not properly transmitted and it slips. Replacing the plastic nylon gear can usually solve the issue. It is recommended to replace the small pinion gear as well for a complete repair. Watch BBS HD Motor Repair Guide Video Part 1 for the replacement method. Please show a lot of interest in electric bicycles and Dr. Road from Mobilent. Subscribing and liking the video will greatly support the production process. Thank you for watching.